I'm Loki, and welcome to my new home. It's a comfortable home, stocked with lots of food and toys. Best of all, I have owners who love and care for me. But before this, I roamed the streets alone. I wouldn't be here, though, if it weren't for animal care and control. Let me tell you a little bit about this wonderful place and how my journey to my forever home all began. It started a few months ago. Things weren't so great for me. I used to have a family that took care of me, but one day they moved away and left me behind. No one was there to fill my food bowl, so I wandered outside and searched for a meal and a warm place to sleep. But one day, everything changed. An officer who found me roaming outside placed me in a carrier and put me in his van. I wasn't sure where we were going, but I had a warm blanket, food and water. Best of all, I was safe. We drove around and picked up a few others. Officer in need of assistance from animal control. That's when I met my friend Bobby. Looks like you have a microchip. I bet your owner is worried about you. Let me give them a call so I can get you home. Hmm, they didn't answer. Don't worry, we'll get you home soon. Oh boy, I'm glad to be out of the cold. Did the officer find you too? Yeah. My owner was walking me when I saw a rabbit. I just love rabbits. I darted after it and accidentally yanked my leash from my owner's hands. I just kept running until I realized I was lost. That's when this van pulled up and here I am. Thankfully I have this microchip. What's a microchip? It's this tiny device inserted under my skin that helps people know who my owners are. It didn't even hurt. You should get one. That way you'll never have to worry if you get lost. What got you running around outside alone? My owners moved away and I couldn't go with them. So they left me behind. That's a real shame. I have a good feeling these people want to help us, though. Welcome to Animal Care and Control. Let's get you two settled in. The nice people who work at the shelter brought us through the building. I was amazed at all I saw. It was a busy place, and we weren't the only ones who showed up that day. There were cats, lizards, guinea pigs, birds, dogs, even a peacock. All right, Bobby, this is where you'll be staying for a bit. We'll try to get a hold of your owners. Show's over, boys. Okay, Loki, wait here. The vet will see you shortly. I waited for the vet and watched the other animals. The vet was so nice. He spayed and neutered some of the animals, which is a simple surgery that prevents animals from having babies. It's important for keeping us healthy, and it also helps prevent pet overpopulation, so there aren't more animals without homes. Some got vaccines, which is another procedure for maintaining our health. And some got microchips, just like the one Bobby had. And guess what? I got all three. Speaking of Bobby, I wonder how he's doing. Great news, Bobby. Your owners are here to take you home. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, I've missed them. Thanks to his microchip, we were able to contact you. Bobby, I'm so glad they found you. Yay! Come on, let's go home. All right, Loki, you're all set to go. My name is January. You must be the new guy. I guess I am. So what happens now? Well, this is where we wait to be adopted. 
Animal care and control takes us in no matter who we are. This place doesn't give up on us. They work really hard to find us a home. You and I are next, little buddy. And as they say, the rest is history. A nice lady came and adopted me. She brings me fresh water and food and buys me fun new toys. We play and cuddle every day. Ugh, I just love it here. To find new homes for animals and reunites owners with their lost pets. Fort Wayne Animal Care and Control is a really important place to have around. During my journey through the shelter, I got to meet everyone from the Animal Care and Control team. There was the officer who picked me up that day, the volunteer staff who fed me and gave me water, the adoption counselors who helped me find a new family, the vet who worked on me to ensure I was good and healthy. Thanks to him, I also have my own microchip, so if I'm ever lost, my owners will just be a phone call away. Although, I can't imagine I'll be running after any rabbits in the near future. Silly Bobby, home is just too good. Well, thanks for letting me share my story. And remember, when your family is ready for a pet, adoption is always best. There are a lot of animals, just like me at shelters, who need families. 